a stream adjusts its channel over time in order to achieve a balance between its flow and the solid load of silt, sand, gravel, and larger particles it carries along. Initially, the stream simply flows downhill to the sea or into local depressions which fill and overflow. Fluvial action smooths the profile into a uniform curve, eliminating lakes and rapids. The stream is exactly as steep as it needs to be to transport its load. Over time, the graded profile is lowered. To see how a stream adjusts its channel, we need to look closely where the changes take place. First, in an area of steep gradient. Capacity to move bed load increases with velocity. Thus, hydraulic action and abrasion are most active in rapids. The channel is lowered by removing alluvial material and bedrock. Second, let us look closely at an area of low water velocity, a lake. In still water, velocity needed to transport bed load is lost. The lake gradually fills with sediment. As the lake's outlet is cut down, the stream incises its channel into this wedge of sediment. Changes in volume of flow also affect the grading process. To visualize this, we'll observe a flood event. In flood, flow increases, greatly enhancing the power of the stream to move bed load. And the stream cuts into its bed, widening and deepening its channel. As the flood recedes, the process is reversed. Decreased flow lowers the stream's capacity to carry bed load, and sediment is redeposited in the channel.